Hello Android gamers, today I'm going to show you how to play Quake 3 Arena on your Android device. First off, go to the Google Play Store and download and install this great free app. This is Quake 3 Arena from Source for your Android device. Come check it out here and give the developers some feedback. First off, get this installed on Android. Next, get Quake 3 Arena installed onto your computer. Once you have both installed and ready, navigate to the location where you installed the Quake 3 game. I put it in a nice easy to find location in C games and Quake 3. This base Q3 folder is the folder that contains all the data we're interested in. Once you've located it, plug in your Android device. Open up your Android device. We're going to put this into the internal memory the root directory, which will be the location that will open up when you plug in the USB cable. Once here, you're going to create a new folder. Call this folder QIII4A. Open up this folder. Copy the base Q3 folder into this folder. Once all the data has been copied over to your Android device, you'll be ready to launch the application and play the game. We're going to go check it out now. Now that all our game data is transferred over to our Android device, and we have the app installed from here in the Play Store, we're ready to play the game. You can either open it from the link here, or the link on your home screen. Let's start it up. Here in the Options menu, you can change the default location where you put the game data. You can do that by editing this line here. Next up, you can try out the controls. I'll be using a Bluetooth mouse and keyboard. You'll need rooted super user permissions to do this, and check these boxes here. By default, you'll have on-screen config controls. This will be the default layout. Click this bar to get more. Drag them up, resize them, and move them around to your liking. Click the other bar to get back, and this is what it'll look like on your screen. Once you've got it set up the way you want it, check out the graphics setting. You can try upping them if you've got a powerful device. And then you'll be ready to run the game. Now let's play some Quake 3. There's some Quake 3 Arena on Android. I'll be running this on my HP touchpad, a dual core device with one gig of memory. You can expect similar performance. Try a little death match. As you can see, the performance is quite good. Any dual core device will give you good performance in this game.
can win. If you have a legit CD key, you can play this online. Cannot find my CD. You can play it without the key, but not online. That's right. I can win. There you have it. Quake 3 Arena running really well on Android. As you can see, I can bring up the multiplayer, but I can't load it. As much as I'd like to. But you get that far. Pretty cool. Check it out. Please like the video and subscribe to see the latest updates of gaming on Android. All these games are available to play on Android. I have videos on each and every one of them, how to play them. All the Quake games, Return to Castle Wolfenstein, and Doom 3. Check it out. Thanks for watching.